everyone. My name is Ashley Valde. I'm a therapist at Social Thinking Stevens Creek, and I wanted to share an activity with you guys today for teaching thinking with your eyes, and especially that our eyes are like arrows. So I used a visual that I kind of created earlier today, but I often create these in real time with my students. And the idea behind this one is that we are teaching our kids that eyes are like arrows. Our eyes move in our heads, and so I like to use uh, this format because it allows me to kind of play with that idea. So what I'm going to do is leave these eyes blank when I start, but then I'm going to start drawing in the pupils as I teach this concept. And I help my kids think about the fact that eyes are like arrows. And what I especially love is I even get to draw arrows with this format. So I use the arrow function to show that the eyes are linked to what we're looking at. So in this case, our person's eyes are pointing to the tree. And that often means, right, what we're looking at is often what we're thinking about. So his eyes are pointing to the tree, so he is most likely thinking about that tree. And so we kind of talk about that idea together. Eyes are like arrows, they point to what we're looking at, and what we're looking at is what we're thinking about. That's why we call it thinking with your eyes. So I love this activity, and I get to kind of play with it and redo it and even let my students draw. So by undoing that function, I also get the opportunity to start all over again and do it in a different direction. So here we can see now their eyes have moved, and instead of thinking about the tree, now their eyes are pointing to the sun. He's thinking about the sun. Perhaps he's thinking he needs some sunglasses. So that's just a fun way to get started and teach your students that eyes are like arrows. And I hope that you find it enjoyable as well.